love the greyhounds because they're like big couch potatoes. They are affectionate, but not needy. They are lazy, but they get bursts of energy. Um, I like to take long walks. And these dogs, I came to find out, they don't need to go jogging. They don't need to go running on the beach. They don't need to go for long, wild, rugged hikes in the mountains. They do love laying on the couch with me and watching TV or re while I'm reading, they're at my side, but never it never feels like a clingy th type of personality. And that's always been really appealing to me. Another important thing to me about greyhounds is that Barbara screens each of them and really understands and knows each individual greyhound's personality so that before the greyhound is placed in a home environment, Barbara has a really good idea about who the greyhound is going to be most suited to, whether it's a greyhound that has a strong prey drive and is going to want to go after cats or the, a greyhound that's much shyer and is going to need a little more coaxing or to be even to be left alone a little bit more in order to get used to living in a home. Barbara and the Home Stretch program, they provide an invaluable service for helping these greyhounds go from living in an institutional track-based setting to learning, wow, this is new. Uh, I've never walked up steps if I'm a greyhound. I've never walked up and down steps. I've never ridden in a passenger car. I've never maybe seen a cat. The greyhounds just have this wonderful opportunity to learn and experience all these new things before they go to their forever home. It's not in my mind about how beautiful the dog is, and so many of them are so beautiful. I don't need a dog that matches my furniture, but I want a dog that's going to be with me, that's going to accept love from me, who's going to love me in return. And that is the most important, I think, of all. Greyhounds make amazing pets. First of all, they come to <laughs> they come to you, um, and they're pretty much usually already potty trained because they're crate trained at the track, so um, they are easy to manage that way. And um, they don't do a lot of things that a lot of other dog breeds do. Like they don't um, dig that much. They don't bark. They don't do a whole lot of other behavioral issues that you have with other dogs. So you get them. They're pretty much already potty trained and. Um, you just show them where their bed is and, and um, take it from there. Um, many people who start looking at greyhounds or who come to the meet and greets and have never seen a greyhound before, they are very surprised at how easy these guys are um, to acclimate to a family and to live with. They are quiet, they are clean, they are polite, they're not always in your face. Um, they're very sensitive to their surroundings and they try to fit in. They try to do their best to fit in. Um, 
and people often think that they're going to be crazy lunatics because of their race dogs and it's just not the case Though sometimes they are uh, and um, the way they are able to transform people's lives is pretty incredible and I mean they're dogs but they're they're a little different and um, we oftentimes have people who were never intending to get a second dog or a third dog or a fourth dog come back and get more um, because they are so easy and because they are so um, I don't know sort of healing the, the energy is very um, quiet and um, they, they, I don't know what it is really. They, they, they are just, they're kind of special. And um, I'm apparently not the only person who thinks so. <laughs>